going to work okay because I'm excited for today's show. Let me know guys how it is. Okay, let's get the Instagram back up. Okay, cool. It's working. So, let's give it another go. <laughs> um, we were talking about this 80s Chanel vintage brooch. This is in 24 karat gold hardware. It has the um, quilted details throughout the, the metal, which is really, really beautiful. This is a very iconic and classic design for the um, 80s. And you can wear this in so many ways. A great thing about this piece is it does actually have a small gap in, in, the, in between like the CC logo, which allows you to thread a chain through. So you can actually wear this as a necklace. Obviously with a brooch, there's so much you can do, um, even on just any plain t-shirt. For example, this one today, I probably place this kind of just towards the top of the top. You could also go into the center and even with a nice white shirt or any color shirt, in fact, actually around the collar detail of a shirt, it looks absolutely stunning. Um, I would give this a good eight out of 10 in condition. Hi everyone. I'd give this a good eight out of 10 in condition. It definitely is one of the most classic and collectible brooches within the Chanel history. Um, okay, we have our first item. So I'm hoping we're on a roll here, guys. It's pinned now. So if you missed the first part of the show and you guys are interested in this brooch, then all you have to do is click on the icon, which is pinned in that top left-hand corner. You'll see further images and details of this beautiful Chanel brooch. This is available for £1,250, which is $1,450 US dollars. And we cover your customs and duties and we ship worldwide, guys. Shipping is between um, £10 and, and £35, depending on where you're located in the world. And it's a very collectible piece. You guys can find that through the icon, which is pinned. I'm going to do a couple more accessory pieces. Um, we'll see how we get on with the Wi-Fi. I'm hoping it's going to work, but I think I think we're on a roll here. Um, the next piece, I'm going to I'm going to stick with the brooch theme here. I'm going to show you guys something a bit more um, of a statement, something slightly larger in size. This is um, kind of resembles a four leaf clover design. And Coco Chanel herself, she was very superstitious as a woman. She was um, into, you know, her um, lucky symbols and her star signs. And the four leaf clover obviously is a symbol for good luck. So you'll see the four leaf clover design throughout a lot of the early stages of Chanel. And even now they still include it because it's quite an iconic um, emblem for the house of Chanel. This is stunning. Honestly, the way that this kind of crisscrosses, you've got that CC logo into the middle. Um, the year of this is a 1995. So it is that very much that iconic year of Chanel jewelry. And it's in honestly pristine condition. There's minimal signs of wear to the back. There's no tarnish. The gold is bright and shiny and sparkly as we want it. And this one, especially because of the shape with a shirt, if you were to put that into the center of a collar of a white shirt, honestly, you have to try it. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. It completely transforms the look of something really classic and simple. Um, and you can, you know, add some gold and some sparkle. You could also actually add this onto a chain and wear it as a necklace. I think it would look amazing as a necklace. And something like this, you can literally place on literally any part of your top. I also love to wear mine personally around, especially with tailored trousers such as these. Um, on like a belt loop around the waist, you could go kind of central with it and create kind of a belt style. Um, but yeah, really play around with brooches. I haven't moved permanently, Dipti. I'm actually back on, I'm back Tuesday. I'll, back, I'll be back in London on Tuesday, taking a day, a day off on Friday to enjoy the weekend. Um, but yeah, I, I'm, not, I'm not permanently here, although I would like to be permanently here, but London, London is calling guys for November. Um, this one is really special. The price is also fantastic on this. Kristen, if you want to do some nice prices today, go for it. Um, yeah, <laughs> we are manifesting. I know. I love New York, guys. It, it literally feels like home. It's, it's a really, really special place for me. Um, but this is £1,150, which is US dollars for a very collectible 1995 Chanel brooch in a really amazing size. Also in the hair, these look amazing. If you guys um, like to plait your hair or wear ponytails, you can in fact put them uh, around the back and the top of the braids and it looks amazing. So try it, experiment with them. Also with hats and heads, um, headwear, even head scarves. 
Um, they look amazing, kind of just accessorised on um, headwear pieces as well. So play around with them. Um, I can see a request coming through. Cece, your first request, um, you asked the caramel flap. We'll move on to that next for you. And then I will show some wallet on chains as well. But in the meantime, guys, if you do want this Chanel brooch, you can find it through the icon, which is pinned in that top left-hand corner. Now the caramel flap, I have a feeling you mean this jumbo beauty to the bottom of our shelves today. So when Chanel, obviously every year, even every season, they do come out with new colors and tones. Um, and beige is one of those colors, like there isn't just one kind of shade of beige that makes it beige. This um, beige comes in lots of different uh, kind of like shades and tones seasonally. And this one is actually, Oh, the one on top. Okay, I'm going to do this one anyway because I really love this, but I'll move on to that next week so you see. This is very much like a milky tea beige. Um, it has like white and cream undertones. If you do prefer slightly lighter beige tones, this would be a great one. And this is actually in caviar leather as well. Um, so you've got a caviar leather, kind of a milk tea beige here with a silver hardware finish. Gives a really classic, really timeless and very much an elegant combination. This is a jumbo classic flap and the jumbo is... Personally, for me, my favorite size in the classic flap range. I think it's great for daytime, but it also can carry on into the evenings as well. I do feel like the maxi can be slightly too big of an evening, but the jumbo for me is a great day to night piece. Um, it does also have a back pocket, just like any classic flap. We've got 90 people on here already, guys. Hi everyone um, we do have a nice spacious back pocket which is great for a phone great for keys anything you need to access easily and then with the double chain you can in fact style this in different ways which I'll show you guys shortly everything I'm showing today is like a one condition um, I've picked pieces today if you guys are looking for great deals um, but you want excellent condition pieces this is the live show for you guys this is a one condition there's no corner wear no scuffing to the leather the leather is puffy and shiny we've got no color transfer to the back even on a cream leather it's absolutely fabulous condition and if you were to buy this in store currently i think they're retailing for around the eight and a half to nine thousand pound mark which you know is exceeding the birkin prices now chanel really have up their game up their pricing and that will only continue so you guys get a pristine condition jumbo flat bag today for under retail it is a double flat it also comes let's see what it comes with also comes with its original felt it is a 15 series, um, so relatively newer, I would say. Comes with its um, care booklet, um, serial code is intact, and the price is on screen, guys. It's £7,250, which is US dollars and with customs and duties covered, especially if you're shopping from outside of the US, you would be paying, honestly, up to 20% on top of the price you see on the screen. So it's a great advantage for you guys to be able to shop with us on the live shows today uh, because we cover those customs and duty fees and you guys can get your hands on some amazing deals. This is available now. Um, the chain length usually on the jumbo is of a slightly longer length for a more casual crossbody. Oh, thank, oh yes, <laughs> when I said that, I was like, why did I not pick up on that, Kristen? <laughs> Sorry guys, the dollar price is eight, I was like, 1,000? <laughs> uh, 8,428 US dollars. Guys, if it was 1,000, I would have expected to hear a sold already. Um, but it is available now for uh, just that $8,000 mark. Um, it's pinned here, there's more images. It's a pristine condition piece. Um, corner wear is minimal, inside is excellent condition, and it is a double flap as well, so you also have, yeah, Leslie, right? We also have that underneath flap as well. And yeah, as Kristen's saying, this is 10,000 in store now, which is an insane price. Um, you guys can get this for thousands less with us today. Um, and it's an absolutely beautiful shade of kind of a cream beige, a really nice kind of wintry, wintry autumn tone, but will also carry you really nicely into the summer as well. Um, let's do this beautiful flat bag at the top here that CC managed to spot. You guys always spot some pieces behind me during the show. Now, this is a medium classic flap, but this is no ordinary classic flap. This is like a pearly, iridescent, absolutely stunning, stunning piece. Um, it's crafted from lambskin. It has that metallic pearl finish. So it almost has purpley, um, purpley undertones with that pearly finish. I would say this is a kind of more of a rosy antique rose pink. It's not a bright Barbie pink. 
it's not um you know it's not too too girly it has that antique rose pink finish which is definitely a pink i would personally wear um especially with the pearly finish it just gives this bag an extra sparkle and an extra lift i also love the fact that this is with silver hardware i think it tones down the gold slightly and gives more of a elegant and uh, more of a chic look um, and again literally pristine condition minimal wear we've got puffy lambskin leather we've got excellent condition hardware and excellent condition corners as well honestly look at this bag in the light this is so amazing um it is a double flap i think this is a small this feels like a nine inch to me yeah that's it kristen um, this feels like a small and um, the small classic flap measures nine inches wide this is a double flap with that really lovely again um, underneath pocket which is great for credit cards and cash um, and then you'll have that really lovely cc stitch logo into the center let's see what it comes with inside reveals a lambskin lined interior with that pearly finish to match this is a 24 series, so again, relatively new actually. Lots of our pieces today are slightly newer season, which means you can get your hands on newer season pieces for less than retail, which is what we like to hear. Um, the nine inch classic flap, let's see how long the chain is as a crossbody. Isn't it so special? You, you never see this, and especially this kind of color, this is not something that uh, you'll see again probably in the Chanel stores for another, you know, 10, 15 years. This is definitely a seasonal colour for that 24 series mark. Um, seasonal tones, they may come about again, they may not. You never know. It just really depends on um, what they launch seasonally. Um, it's a great size. The small is perfect for your small essentials like your phone, a small card holder, some, you know, small makeup bits, all of your small essentials that you need. And the small does have a slightly higher cross as well um, which sits kind of like mid waist length it's around a 17 or 18 inch drop now just bear in mind I am 5 foot 11 so I am very much on the taller side um, and if it fits me as a crossbody it's going to fit you guys as well um, it just will be slightly more snug into the hip January how beautiful is this I'm obsessed and I'm actually really, really impressed with the price of this. I was expecting to see around the seven and a half thousand for a color like this and a condition like this as well. Um, this is 6,750 pounds, which is 7,847 US dollars. And the customs and duties are covered. We do ship worldwide. You guys will receive these items literally within a matter of days. And you can get your hands on this very special pearly. Oh, I think that's the wrong one actually, Kristen. Do you want me to type the skew for you? Hang on. Yeah, that's not the right one. I do also have that one behind me as well. Q6B01. Sorry, bear with me, guys. IP011. Okay, that should be the one. Um, we'll wait until we get the correct price on this and we'll get that pinned. In the meantime, guys, how are we? How is everyone? Kristen, how are you? Um, welcome everyone. This will be one of my last shows from New York. Unfortunately, I will be heading back to London. Um, I'm excited to see the team though. Today we're showing kind of A1 condition pieces. We have some vintage, but we've also got some amazing more current season pieces as well. Um, that is the one, really. That looks like the classic flap that I have here. I have another classic flap. Um, maybe it's just the lighting and the images. Okay guys, I mean, go for it. The skew matches, that's it. This is the bag. It probably shows up very differently in the light that I have in front of me. Um, I'll make sure if anybody does check out on that, then um, I'll make sure you guys, it is this bag because the skew matches. So don't worry about that. Uh, Maureen, my husband is driving us back from Disney. Oh, Maureen, um, I went to Six Flags. It's not quite Disney, but I went to Six Flags last weekend and I had the best time. I was like a little kid for the day. It was so much fun. Disneyland is amazing. Um, so guys, that's up £6,750 for this incredibly beautiful Chanel small classic flap. It is this one here, the skew matches. This is the bag you'll get, don't worry. Um, go for it, guys. Somebody has to take this home today. This is a really, really special piece. Okay, 
let's do a wallet on chain. I know somebody was in the market for one. Um, this one is, I think, slightly more current season. Um, wallet on chain is definitely a must have if you're looking to build a classic Chanel collection of pieces. It's a great kind of all occasion, all season bag, especially in this really beautiful cherry red color. It is just such a classic color, which is going to go with everything in your wardrobe. I even love red with like khaki greens and blacks, but it also works nicely with um, uh, like um, beiges and white outfits as well. So it is a really uh, kind of like an all occasion color. It's a cherry red, so it has that dark undertone. And this is in fact caviar leather. Caviar leather is a great all season, um, all year around leather it's slightly more durable so this would make a great everyday bag something you can wear and enjoy and not have to worry about any you know um, obvious signs of wear and scratches if it were lambskin which can happen sometimes so this has the cc stitch logo into the front center and then we do actually have a um, silver hardware chain which gives the bag a really kind of classic and timeless um, combination here this is in again excellent condition i won't spend too much time on conditions today guys because what you get today is like a1 um, but very minimal wear to this um, there's no corner wear scuffing no kind of um, even like obvious signs of wear to the leather at all and then the wallet on chain opens up into a quite a spacious interior actually. The wallet on chain may look compact and small, but you can in fact fit a phone in, you can fit a lipstick in, and you can also fit a set of keys in as well. Kristen, right? There's something really special about this red. It's dark, it's like a cherry red. Um, slightly deeper, slightly more rich, very, very beautiful. I'd love to get kind of a red lip to match. That's how I would style this. Um, so the bag opens up into several compartments towards the back of the wallet on chain. You have around eight card slots, so you can fit all of your cards in there. Um, you also have a small pocket here underneath, which is quite good for cash actually, because it's slightly more hidden. Hey, Kel. You've also got a coin purse with a full functioning zipper lock, so you can keep those loose uh, chains, and, um, chains, coins <laughs> inside here. Change is what I meant to say. And then you also have another compartment to the front. So you can keep your things organized with this. Um, the wallet on chain generally has a lower um, cross. It's uh, more of a relaxed, longer chain to sit kind of just below the hip, which is great for all heights. But for those of you who might want a slightly higher cross or they want to know how to style the wallet on chain differently, I will show you. In the meantime, it's ready to purchase. So if any of you are considering, have a look now. But I will show you what you can do with the wallet on chain. So with this, you can actually cross over the chain, feed it underneath the flap and create this double chain effect here. Um, this is nice. I would wear it personally like this. This is more me, I would say. Um, this is nice for maybe an evening or a special occasion, or when you want the bag just slightly closer to you. For a shorter chain drop across the body, keep it the same, but just pull one of the chains slightly tighter, and that gives a nice chain look across the front of the bag as well, which then gives around an 18 to 19 inch drop as a crossbody, which sits nicely into the waist. Um, if you're looking for more of a clutch bag style, maybe for a wedding or you know an event, Party season is coming up, guys. December is like right around the corner. It's my favorite month of the year because it's my birthday. <laughs> you can actually triple drop the chain underneath, adjust the chain so that they're the same length, and then you have almost like a top handle. So you can use this. Um, this is this is more kind of uh, dressy, more um, event style, special occasions. You can actually create a small top handle with that. And probably my favorite way to wear this, because I kind of like the chain look hanging down across the bag. You can just hang the chains down and very Alexander McQueen style, you can actually just use that as like a hand um, decor piece and, and wear it as a clutch like this as well. Hey, Becca. Um, so guys, this is up. The price is £2,890, which is US dollars She is pinned. You guys can find this through the icon pinned in that top left-hand corner. And again, at any point today, guys, let me know your questions. I love to chat with you guys, especially when I'm doing a show alone. Um, so let me know if you have any questions, but she's a great one. Honestly, a really, really special piece. Okay, let's maybe move away from Chanel. I know I'm very Chanel heavy today, but I do have some really, really cool Louis Vuitton pieces. One piece I would buy, I know Kristen would buy as well, and if Isabel wasn't driving right now, she would be on the show buying this as well. We have today a incredible collector's piece from the Stephen Sprouse Louis Vuitton collaboration collection. 
Steven Sprouse is very much known for his graffiti artwork and his really cool kind of street style art. And with this one, what he did was he basically took Louis Vuitton's classic monogram and placed this graffiti artwork across the wallet. You see this in the Speedies, the Neverfalls, the Keepalls, like it was such an iconic collection. And one good thing about these pieces is, especially the wallets, is not only can you store your money in this, but you'll make money from this as well. Because it's limited edition, you can no longer buy it. The value of this every year will go up and up and up and up. It's literally like sitting on a wallet that makes you money like it's actually insane condition again insane absolutely incredible condition there's no um wear to the paint there's no wear to the corners there's also no wear to the tarnish as well this opens up into a really really spacious wallet you have uh, two sides to keep your things organized nikki if you've got the speedy you need the wallet <laughs> And then you do in fact have, a, 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 again, a coin purse inside here with a zipper lock. Now, if I were, you know, looking to buy something from this collection and you don't want to kind of go into the price points of the Speedies and the Neverfalls because they can be, you know, several thousands, this, is, this for me would be good enough as a clutch bag, but you could also buy maybe a Twilly or you could buy a gold chain. Any gold chain will do, any strap in fact will do. And you can actually just place it underneath the flap here. Once you lock that tight and you have this really nice kind of chain detail, this in itself will look nice over the arm as a pochette. So get creative with it. This doesn't have to just be a wallet. You can create a wallet on chain style with this by simply just adding any kind of chain of your choice. So this is under a thousand pounds. This is 990 pounds, which is a really good price actually. We usually get these for around the 1200 mark. So I'm, I'm impressed with that price. 990 for this, which is 1,150 US dollars um, for a very collectible, insanely, insanely hard, hard find here. Um, we, we get the bags kind of more commonly, but actually the wallets are really, really hard to find. So this is a great piece to purchase today. Um, even the paint you can see is nice and shiny still. It hasn't come off, there's nowhere. Um, and it's a great collector's piece, guys. So she is pinned. It is up in that top left-hand corner. Have a look at the images. Um, and yes, someone has to get this. Nikki, honestly, if you, have the, if you have the bag, I feel like you kind of need this. Especially as well, if you are, um, even with like Chanel jewelry, the brooches, if you find a pair of earrings and a brooch that matches, you could probably add a third on the price just by selling it as a set. So just bear that in mind. If you do come across odd pieces here and there that match, by putting those pieces together, you're creating a set, which means the value is higher. Um, so yeah, that's just a point from me. But yeah, this is a great one. Um, I want to see some of your requests. I want to get through the bags that you guys have spotted behind me. Um, I know, Cal, it's a really, really well, rare wallet, actually. Somebody asked for the blue-green Chanel. Okay, um, OAK, let's do that one next. We're going straight in with one of my favorites today and one of Kristen's favorites as well. Um, I will own this bag one day. <laughs> this is, like, I'm, I'm being like, quite careful at the minute. I know a lot of you guys are on Ban Island with me. Um, but you know, like, when you're around these pieces, you really do find the pieces that you want and they stick in your head. And I do actually have a list, like, one day I will have this, 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 and this. This is on my list. Like, this is an insanely collectible, ultra, ultra rare Chanel um, caviar tote bag. Um, Peggy, I don't have any Chanel belts today, but please send me an email, grace at luxurypromise.com. Um, I'll spend some time this evening looking to see if I have anything left at all in stock. I'm actually not, um, I'm in another location today, guys. It's a secret location. I'm in another location today, um, so I, I don't have access to the stock, but I'll be having a look through later. Um, maybe I'll do some, maybe I'll do a story takeover, or I'll do a power hour or something on Instagram tomorrow before um, I head out on annual leave. Um, but this is a turquoise Chanel caviar tote bag that fits a laptop, it fits magazines, it fits books. It's a great everyday size, especially if you do carry, um, take all my money, right, <laughs> for this. I agree. Um, the color is absolutely incredible. It really is a true turquoise, like a lagoon blue. And paired with that gold hardware, obviously you can see this is the 24 karat gold gilded. This is an exceptional piece. It really, really is. And guys, the condition is amazing. There's no uh, there's nowhere to the base. I'm sure we can do some auctions, maybe. Kristen, if you, if you see something you think we should auction, let me know. 
It also has a nice exterior back pocket. So you've got a nice spacious back pocket here. I would put my wallet in here, my keys and my phone, the things that I need to grab and use all the time would go in that front pocket. But you do actually also have another pocket here as well, which is great for an iPad. This is actually great for a laptop and also great for like magazines and stuff as well if you're traveling. I, I, I say magazines, I, I take magazines everywhere with me when I'm traveling. I don't know if you guys do as well. Um, and then we've got this beautiful turquoise zipper lock pull, the nice comfortable straps and a wrap around zip which opens up into such a spacious compartment. Inside is lined with canvas, again, exceptional condition. Hey Barbie, we can auction this on if you want. Yeah, if you want to do it, let's do it. I'm feeling fun today. I'm in a good mood today, guys. Let's do some auctions. I love auctions, they're so fun. Let me find the year. They're usually like a three or four series. late 90s guys in excellent condition i guess we're auctioning for this let me know i might even actually jump in on this auction myself <laughs> um but isn't she beautiful honestly a bag that we will we never really see the last one i saw was actually last time i was here in july we very rarely come across colorful caviar let alone this beautiful kind of lagoon turquoise tone um, this bag is absolute perfection for all seasons, all year, and this colour goes with everything. So whoever gets this today is a lucky lady or gent. I never know whether we have gentlemen on here watching. Um, if there are any men on here, say hi. I would love to know what interests you on our live shows or any husbands looking to shop for their wives. Let me know. Um, the Kelly, Ada the Kelly is under 20,000. So get ready for the Kelly behind me. It's absolutely an insane price. We're going to auction this, guys. So if you are new to our live shows and you're new to the auctions, I'll give you guys a quick rundown. So we will have a starting bid. Kristen's going to let us know the starting bid in the comments. And you guys have to, um, basically, you have two minutes to bid and you have to bid in increments of £50. Um, so I'll start the timer and then you guys have two minutes to get your bids in and then whoever the highest bidder is at the end of the two minutes wins dibs on this bag and has 10 minutes to check out on the item. I can feel this auction is going to be crazy, so I'm excited to do this. Um, somebody has to get this today, and I'm sure as well with the auction, you guys are going to get an amazing deal. Let's see. Drum roll. <laughs> Starting bid is nuts. I'm ready. Let's do it. <laughs> Isn't it so good? Oh, okay, guys, that price. I'm starting the countdown now, guys. You've got two minutes to bid higher than £3,850 for this incredible 90s Chanel caviar vintage tote bag. Whoever is the highest bidder on my screen at the end of the two minutes wins dibs on this bag. I've sold these for nearly 5,000, so that starting bid is insane, guys. And remember, if nobody bids, you win at the starting bid. So we're starting at 3,850 pounds. Tiffany Blue is so big at the moment, Nikki. You, I, you're so right with that. Um, you want it in black, door. We do get it in black, actually, from time to time. Donna's in at 350 pounds. So she is our first bidder today, guys. Um, 350 pounds. Um, please make sure to bid in increments of £50 or higher. If you guys want to place your maximum purchase bid, you absolutely can. You just set the ball higher for everybody else. Sometimes that happens and then you guys, you guys win. So you have got another minute. Donna is currently our highest bidder at £3,850. You guys have got under a minute left. She's in excellent condition. She fits a laptop. You've got multiple pockets and compartments. That price should be illegal. <laughs> Donna is currently winning. Now what happens here is in the last 10 seconds, you all go crazy in the bids. So I would load up your maximum budget for this bag and then I'll do a 10 second count because honestly, and remember I have a slight lag on my screen as well. So just bear that in mind 
guys, you've got 20 seconds left to bid. Currently, Donna is the leading bid. We've got HB in at £3,950. We've got 15 seconds left, guys. HB is our winning bid at £3,900. I'm going to start my 10 second countdown now, okay? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one. I always have to give five seconds at the end. Okay. Donna is the winner, guys. Donna, that price is amazing. Oh my goodness, Donna, congratulations. You have just won this Chanel turquoise tote bag at £3,950. You now have 10 minutes to check out. Everybody, Donna's got, bit, uh, Donna's got dibs on this. So she has 10 minutes to check out at that price. And then if she doesn't check out, it will be the next person um, to check out on this bag. Huge congratulations. This is uh, honestly an amazing piece. Um, you got an amazing price on that as well, Donna. So huge congratulations. I'm super jealous of that one. It's absolutely fabulous. So I did see somebody asking about the, it doesn't come with card on it, it just has its um, uh, serial code intact. It's a five series. Um, so that's the late 90s, I think that's 1997. Yeah, 97 roughly. Um, somebody asked about the Chanel white bag that we have and it, I must say this is such a beautiful classic. Um, this is lambskin leather, it is quilted and we do have that 24 karat gold hardware finish to the gold which looks absolutely amazing against white lambskin like honestly this bag is absolutely beautiful and um, this opens up into a single flap underneath the flap you've got this beautiful detail here there's something really special about white chanel bags i don't know what it is i just think they're absolutely beautiful and even that gold font underneath it says chanel and also that cc stitch logo underneath the flap is absolutely beautiful um, the bag is uh, kind of the equivalent to a mini classic flap um, slightly different I would say it is kind of like a single flap but you have more of a unique shaped flap at the front here and then inside you've got several compartments you've got a zipper lock closure a small lipstick holder several compartments here and then the main uh, the main compartment of the bag this is a two series Chanel so that is a 1991 to 1993 she does not come with a card but she is in pristine pristine condition I'll show you the back now, sometimes, obviously, white, you guys know, is naturally more of a delicate um, colour, something that you do have to be slightly um, careful with. This is, considering this is 1991, we have barely any signs of wear here. Quite commonly, you'll see uh, darkening to the back, especially if you wear darker tones with white or just, you know, if you wear a jacket and it might not be like the cleanest, you can actually get colour transfer on the back. This has nothing. This is 1991, pristine white lambskin it's not cream it is a true kind of snow white we have no corner wear no darkening maybe one tiny tiny mark there but that's me being really 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 particular um i'm going to show you that next sarah yeah you guys are not ready for the price of the kelly um literally excellent condition minimal signs of wear no tarnish to the gold and she has a beautiful classic crossbody quilted strap a slightly lower cross actually so it's a nice comfortable fit as a cross um, it's in excellent condition and you could actually with this potentially double up the chain if you wanted to to create a slightly smaller length chain um, but again i've shown you the, tr the tricks earlier with the wallet on chain play around with it you can pochette style if you wanted now this is available for uh, five thousand 390 pounds which is 6268 us dollars and remember guys we cover your customs and duties you're saving around a thousand pounds by shopping with us today and avoiding those customs fees it is an exceptional bag from the early 90s white lambskin pristine condition and it is up in that top left hand corner this is stunning now, I know a lot of you are waiting for the Kelly, so we are half an hour in, and I'm more than happy to do this now. I'm so excited to show you this today. Um, this is a Kelly 25 bag in classic black with gold hardware. Now, if I'm correct, this looks like Swift leather. 
Um, and Swift Leather is Sabrina's favorite leather. Also one of my favorite leathers because it actually has no grain. It is similar to box, no grain, but it has um, a slightly more of a matte finish. Ada, yeah, it's Swift. Swift is a soft leather. It doesn't slouch too much though. That's the good thing with Swift. Um, especially with this size, the 25, it will hold its shape really nicely um, and it will keep this beautiful matte finish and the gold hardware is absolutely stunning. Now the 25 is one size up from the mini. It is for me the perfect, perfect size for evening and daytime. It can carry you from day to night and for events, special occasions and also casual evenings and events as well. Um, I'll open the bag up, but you, could, you guys can see the condition. There's literally minimal wear. Um, there's no corner wear. There's no uh, wear to the base. Honestly, I can't remember the last time we had a black Swift Kelly, and I really cannot. Like, I've, I haven't seen one in so, so long. Um, once the bag is open, you'll see the real beauty of Swift leather. It sits and hangs really elegantly and quite effortlessly, actually. Um, Swift is softer and more supple. And some might say that Swift is actually slightly more durable because the bag has um, like a like a bounce to it. The leather has like a slight bounce to it, whereas with Epsom, it's quite a stiff structured leather. So if you kind of accidentally knock the bags on somewhere, it has more resistance, which means, you know, less scratching. Um, as you can see here, the bag's open and it's beautiful. This is personally how I like to wear them, just undone, very elegant and kind of effortless. Um, the inside of the bag is in, again, pristine condition. Becca, it's your dream bag. I feel like I say that like five times a day. <laughs> um, it also comes with its keen clochettes and it does have, it does have its strap as well. And it's in the matching Swift leather. Let me show you guys what this looks like on. Um, so this is pristine condition, no corner wear, no wear to the leather. The seals are not on, but the hardware is literally perfection. I would give this, you know, a, a good nine out of 10 condition. This is what it looks like as a cross. And this is exactly what I mean with the Swift leather. It's softer. It kind of molds nicely to the body. It's more comfortable and just looks so, so beautiful. Um, it comes with key crochet and strap. I'll give you guys the stamping as well. It's a slightly newer season if the stamping's down the side. It's a tea stamp. Oh, hey, you, sir. I can show you that one next. Um, it's a tea stamp. Let me see if I can get the year. Um, but it is, I think it's kind of post 2015. Let me have a look. Um, Kristen, are you able to look that up for me? Oh, there we go, 2015. Okay, I need to like, stick to my uh stick to my gut so it's 2015 um this is under 20,000 guys this is 19,995 pounds which is 23,250 pounds for a kelly 25 swift honestly that price is amazing i did bring the price down just a little bit it was uh, more around the 22,000 but i wanted somebody to take this home today um, as i just don't know when we're going to get another swift swift black kelly and again especially in a 25 in this condition it's a real gem today of our show um, and yeah you guys let me know if you've got questions about this it is pinned um, this is going to be live for the for the next hour and a half um, and then these items will be taken offline so you guys have got you know some time to think um, <laughs> I know Sabrina bless her she's probably spending time with family it's late in London now and you so we do have some really beautiful pieces today I'm actually in a secret location okay kind of a1 can give you guys a bit of a different um, different selection today I'm gonna put this one back up here on her beautiful shelf and leave her to to sit and stare at you all and we can move on to the other mermaid bag that we have today this comes as a full set this comes with its box it has um, its strap and i'll show you guys the inside of the bag um, i don't have any goyard today um anetta i'm sorry i don't i do still have one that was on my show yesterday um that was a really great one it was a gray um tote bag and it actually has the reinforced leather corners as well so it's quite a durable one so have a look i think it's still online 
Uh, but we're, we're gonna move on to this absolutely beautiful Chanel Coco handle. This is in caviar leather. And the only way that I could describe this color, I'm just like, it's just mermaid. <laughs> like it's got purple hues, silver hues, slight blue undertones. And that's the beauty of this leather, this metallic leather from Chanel kind of in different lights shows different tones. And it is just, it does actually have brushed gold hardware. It's not new, Anetta. It does have some slight corner wear. I, I think I rated it a seven or an eight out of 10 condition. It just had a scuff to the corner, but it was a really, really great condition. And I can pick that up for you tomorrow if you wanted to go ahead with that. Um, if not, I can send you some more pictures after the show. But this one here is A1 condition. No signs of wear to the base. Um, it does come with its strap and it is, again, this is like the perfect day to night bag. The top handle gives it more of a evening kind of um, elegant feel and then that crossbody is much more practical and goes really nicely as a cross. We do also have a green one as well. Yeah, green Goyard. Um, the gray one yesterday was on another show and then I do have a green uh, Goyard tote also. Um, turn lock opening, single flap and then the trendy bag well, this is more like the cocoa handle, has separate sections inside. Um, just quickly so you guys are aware, anything that's 2000 and, um, 2022 Chanel, they no longer come with cards. And what they've actually done more recently is they have included a plaque sticker inside, which is made of metal, which also includes a microchip inside. So if you are um, looking to purchase a new season Chanel bag and you wonder why it doesn't have a card, they no longer come with them. So anything post 2022, all you have to look for is that plaque inside and that unique code to the bag, which I think is great. You don't have to worry about the serial code coming off or losing the card. It makes our lives a whole lot easier um, when looking after our Chanel pieces. Crossbody is absolutely perfect. Um, sits kind of um, hip length. This is really, really beautiful. Honestly, this is so special. Perfect for, you know, brightening up an outfit. Um, also with the metallics, this is going to go with everything. It's kind of got lots of different tones to it. So I feel like whatever you wear, you can just pick this up and use it. It's an easy bag to use. Add a bit of sparkle to your look as well. The strap is detachable. You've got these Chanel um, CC lock closures to each side. So if you want to wear it with or without, you have the option to. And like mentioned, this comes with its original box, even its original kind of um, papers inside, and also its dust bag. It's a beautiful one. Um, let me show you close-ups, and then we can get the price up of this. It's the small, um, small top handle, pristine condition, current season. This is a seasonal color. You may not be able to ever get this color again. Um, this is 6,250 pounds, which is 7,269 US dollars. Um, and customs and duties are covered, guys. Isn't she beautiful? So nice. I'm actually obsessed. The mermaidy pearly finishes for me are just so special. Um, they make the classics look more unique and, you know, something that not everybody's going to have. This is definitely a bag that I would stop you on the street if you had this bag and be like, oh my gosh, where did you get it? Because um, it's just so special. So let's do some more wallets and then I will move on to another Hermes bag. We do have some more Hermes coming up. So currently, right now, everybody's really into like the 2000s um, collections, like the mirrored speedies, the Cambon range from Chanel, those early 2000s pieces, also like the, um, the medallion tote bag. This particular wallet here is from the Cambon collection. Wow, this angle on Instagram is not great. It's so sorry, guys. I hope you guys can see me okay. Hang on. There we go, that's better. <laughs> they were looking upwards at me from on Instagram. Um, this is from the Cambon collection, early 2000s, and it's crafted from, hey girls, it's crafted from lambskin, and also you've got a painted um, CC logo to the bottom here. The Cambon range is known for its contrasting color tones, and also it's um, quite a statement CC logos, and it's really, really in right now. The best part about this wallet is actually the inside. I'm totally obsessed with this lining. Um, it's a like a really bright fluorescent pink lambskin lining. And you'll see that we've got um, CC logos kind of embedded into the leather inside. 
You've also got card holders here. You've got room for lots of cards. And then you'll also see that it does in fact come with its original Chanel card as well. Um, this is a 22 series, I think. Um, and you've also got a card, like uh, room for a phone in here. You've got room for coins, cards, cash, keys. Like it's almost like a small organizer. It's a really, really good size. I love the way that it kind of opens out. You can keep your things organized. I would personally keep also my uh, passport in here. And this would be great as like a document holder when you're traveling as well. Again, pristine condition. I say very, very light wear inside. There's just, you know, one mark there. But overall, this is an excellent condition piece. Um, and this, guys, would make a great gift for somebody for Christmas. I know it's slightly early, but it's good to be organized and shop in advance because you guys can get the best deals. Um, this would make a great gift as it's in excellent condition. It's from a very iconic collection and you can never go wrong with a wallet. You really, really cannot, especially one with this incredible interior. Um, I love the contrasting so much and it's under 800 pounds. This is 795 pounds, which is 924 US dollars. Um, customs and duties we cover, guys. All of these items will be shipped out tomorrow and Friday to be with you early next week. A great wallet, something you would pay around 1200 in store now. Get it now with us for way, way less, under 800. Click on the icon here and there's more images. And guys, you know what to do if you have any questions, just let me know in that comment box. We're still at 100 people. I'm so excited, guys. Um, I hope you're enjoying the live show so much. We've got um, way more to show you. Um, so stay tuned. I just want to make sure that the turquoise caviar Chanel bag, the lovely lady has checked out. If she hasn't, please make sure to do that. Otherwise, I will have to offer this to the next person who was bidding. She does have dibs though, so nobody check out yet. I think it was Donna, I think. Um, so make sure you make that payment so the bag is yours. Let's do a, let's do the Evelyn. The Evelyn for me, this color is just wow. Um, so this is Clemence. Yeah, this is Clemence. So next up guys, we have a really, really classic bag from the House of Hermes. You guys have been loving the Evelyns, and for me, this color actually has to be one of the favorite ones, my favorite ones I've seen. I believe this is the GM size. Um, but I will measure it actually, maybe it's the PM, maybe it's the GM, I think it might be the GM, I'm going to stick with that, I think it's the GM, which is one of the largest Evelyn's, um, and it really is very much a cool girl bag, it's a great everyday crossbody, uh, kind of more casual style, a grab and go piece, um, it fits a laptop in, you know, you can throw all of your work things in here, if you're travelling, this is just the, the perfect kind of all functioning bag, um, again, another one on my list that I really, really want in this size. Um, the Evelyn comes in two leathers or it comes in like a felt suede. This is actually Clemence leather and Clemence leather has quite a prominent grain to it. And the color here that we have, I don't know the exact name of it, but it is almost like a, I want to say salmony, like a salmony pink, but it's quite neutral actually. It's kind of like a pinky brown beige. Um, really quite classic, a color that's going to go with everything, even with darker tones such as blacks and khaki greens. This is a really kind of nice neutral pink tone. It has very slight contrast stitching as well. You've got kind of a creamy colored stitch. Um, and the Evelyn in this size also comes with um, this nice big back pocket. Kristen, let's see what we can do on that white Chanel. Oh, Donna, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Um, okay, I guess, guys, the blue Chanel is available. If anybody wants to check out, go for it. Is HB still on the live? Is she still here? Let us know, guys, if you're still here, and we'll see what we can do. Um, this comes with its dust bag, which is great, and it also comes with a adjust... Oh, the strap's a different colour. It comes with this adjustable canvas strap, and what you'll see here is this really beautiful, slightly darker pink mixed with the classic pink that the leather is in. Um, the good thing about the Evelyn is actually the length of the canvas. I know the strap's insane. Um, you can wear this at whatever length you wish. It's a bag that fits everyone. Um, are you tagged HB? Yeah, I can show you that, BB. 
Let's adjust this to its shortest so I can show you guys what you can do. Um, there we go. So this is what it looks like. It does look like rouge vif, you're right, Nelsa. On each side here, you've got um, contrasting colors. And then actually to one side of the canvas, you do have just the plain pink as well. So you can wear whichever side you want. As a crossbody, it is just the perfect, easy, everyday style um, um, kind of length. It goes perfectly. It sits on the shoulder. The good thing about the Clemence leather is it molds really nicely into the body. Um, so it's really comfortable, but it also, you know, you can carry a laptop in this. It's, it's what I call stylish yet practical. It's you look great in it, but it's one of those bags that is actually really comfortable as well. And for me, that's super important, especially when you're traveling a lot, you're commuting to and from the office, you need something that's going to, you know, be comfortable to wear, but you also look amazing in it as well. Um, condition on this is excellent. I've just seen the price. I'm actually blown away by that, especially with the contrasting um, contrasting strap. This is three thousand seven hundred and sixty-five pounds, which is four thousand three hundred and seventy-four US dollars. Look at this color! Oh my gosh, this color is amazing. It's what you call like a neutral pink, almost like a salmony undertone, um, in excellent condition, no signs of wear to this, and that strap is just everything, guys. Somebody has to take this today. Um, this is pinned, it is there. I'm gonna quickly go back to the turquoise Chanel. Um, so you guys have uh, the option to go for that if you wanted to as well. But in the meantime, guys, the Evelyn is now available. Hey Jojo, we are completely sold out of those uh, Gucci waist bags. I promise you, when I get one, I'll have you in mind. Hey Jazz, I got the scarf from Sabrina's New York live show. It's supposed to come with free wallet, but I did not get it. Um, Jazz, I saw that was brought up already in our group chat, so I think we are working on fi figuring that out um, already, and someone will get back to you. I can't, I can't look into that right now, but someone will be getting back to you regarding that. And um, we took a hundred pounds off the Chanel White lambskin, and um, that's probably the best we can do on this guy. So a hundred pounds off this. You can find that through the handbag icon at the bottom part of your screen. Let's go back to the turquoise because somebody has to take this today. Remember, guys, we do have split it. So if you wanted to, um, Nikki, the Evelyn. I don't, I don't know whether it's Crevette or it could be, um, it could be, um, is it prawn shrimp? It could be shrimp. It's in that kind of neutral pink family. It's not like a, it's not a bright pink. It could be Crevette or it could be um, shrimp. Um, but it's kind of like a rosy with a slight orangey undertone, neutral. This is a true representation of the color here. So if you guys want to take a quick screenshot, go for it. Um, and then I will definitely do some research into this, but yeah, it could be maybe Crevette or like a shrimp color, but definitely within that kind of neutral pink family. And the turquoise bag that we have available is this one here. Um, the price of this, oh, maybe Crevette and shrimp are the same. <laughs> um, so this is a turquoise um, Chanel bag from the late 90s. We earlier on did an auction on this and the winning bid was £3,850. It should be a thousand more. I'll give you my honest opinion, guys. This should be going for just under 5000 And this is like a holy grail piece. If it's a laptop, it's a great travel bag, great everyday bag. And this colour is a great way to kind of lighten up your um, wardrobe. But also it's an easy colour to pair with everything. So if anybody wants to grab this at £3,850, I'm even, I'm even like... Should I? Um, it's a great one. It's pinned here. Remember, we do have Split It. Split It allows you to split the payment up to 12 months. Um, so if you guys just divide 3850 by 12, that will be your monthly payments. There's no additional fees. Um, so yeah, it's a, it's a really, really good one to get. And that price is absolutely insane. I will show some more wallets. I don't actually have very many more um, available on today's show. And I would actually say these two are probably the only ones I have today, which I've already showed. This Sprouse one was 795. Oh no, it wasn't. This was 795. 
and this was I think just over like nine I think it was nine just over 900 um, great pieces guys and you can find these under the handbag icon which is at the bottom of your screen have a look at what I've shown so far and if you do want me to recap anything just let me know in the comment box I'm going to show you guys another classic um, with a very fun twist from Louis Vuitton this is a Louis Vuitton Times Takashi Murakami artist collaboration. This is the Cherry Murakami um, pochette bag. I believe the cherries were came around in around 2005. Um, and Takashi Murakami is the same um, collaboration as the obviously the multicolored Murakami as well. Um, this has the classic monogram and then also has a beautiful cherry logo here. And what I really love about this particular design is I actually love the red contrast stitching, which you'll see around the edge. It's subtle, but it's there. Like once you notice it, you really appreciate it. That red contrast stitch around the edge here perfectly matches that cherry. This is again, very collectible, a bag that you could not only enjoy, but you can make money from. It was only made one collection. It was limited edition and you can no longer buy them. So obviously as the years go on, these were early 2000s pieces. Um, as the years go on, the price of them only just goes up and up because the demand goes up. So grab them whilst you can, whilst we have access to these amazing pieces. Get them, honestly, if, even if you just want to sit on it and you don't want to wear it, like you'll make amazing money off this over the years to come. It's such a cute bag though to wear. And anybody who knows Louis Vuitton and their collaboration pieces, anybody that sees you in this is going to be like, wow, that person knows, like that's such a collectible bag. Um, you do also have the plain side here, which is great. You will either have the cherry, but you can actually just wear it with the plain side and then you just get that nice kind of contrast red stitch as well. <laughs> Jazz, right? Split it's so good. I use split it. I think why not? Like why not use it? Um, if you can use split it, it's a great way to kind of divide your payments. Makes the transaction feel slightly easier, I would say. Um, this particular one also comes with its original dust bag. Immaculate condition. There's no darkening to the vachetta leather. There's no staining to the inside. And an insanely collectible classic Louis Vuitton Vachette. So we'll get the price up of this one. No darkening to the handle. Excellent condition, beautiful collector's piece. And another thing you can actually do with this is you can unclip one side and then you can attach it to the other. So if you are more of a clutch bag kind of person, you can have it as a clutch with a wristlet as well. So you can kind of carry it as you wish. It's a really, really fun bag. They fit so much inside as well. Like you fit your phone, your wallet, keys, um, lipsticks, makeup, like all of those things, it fits. Um, Jazz, I got my first LV, LV bag from your show. Oh, no way. Oh, Jazz, that makes me so happy. I love it when you guys tell me what you get from my shows. Also, if you if you guys are into Instagram, tag me in your pictures if you're ever wearing something you buy from me because it honestly makes my day. Um, hey, Curtie, I've been waiting on 150 voucher. I won on Sabrina's live show. Reached out to customer care. Never heard back. Um, okay, let me just take a screenshot of that, Curtie, and I'll look into that after the show. And then Kristen's going to let us know the price of this one. I'll give you guys a quick sneak peek of what else we have. Let me know if anything's catching your eye. We do actually have a lambskin pink Chanel bag. Classic flap with its box. We also have a velvet boy bag. We've got a Neverfull. We've got some more Chanel pieces. And I have one special bag in this box. I'm actually so surprised that that um, Kelly hasn't gone. Just on the on the topic of split it, you can actually use split it for the Kelly as well. Um, you can use split it for anything up to 20,000. So if you were considering the Kelly, you can actually just use split it for that and split it over a couple months as well, which is, it makes it slightly easier purchase. Pink Chanel. Okay, Polly, we'll move on to that one next for you. Kristen, are you there? Oh, the price is pinned, where? I don't see it. Let me scroll up. Okay, let me pin that. 
Okay, 1,595 pounds for this which is um, 1,854 US dollars. A great price for a ultimate collector's piece. It's a bit of history and something that you know you can buy as an investment purpose as well. It's a really, really great one. Let's do the pink Chanel. I have a few pink Chanel's, but this one is very, very special. So here we have a Chanel medium classic flap. Um, this comes with its original box and it also comes with its dust bag as well. So this is for me like a really good, oh wow the chain guys, this is no ordinary classic flap. I've just seen like, oh my gosh, I've just seen the chain on this, this is insane. Um, this is a very kind of rosy baby pink colour, I'd say this is like a strawberry milkshake, a true pink. It is lambskin and the hardware is actually um, champagne gold, so we have a champagne gold hardware finish. Look at the chain on this. <gasps> this is stunning. Oh my goodness. So what you can see here is multiple CC logos encrusted with diamantes and pearls. We've got a love heart there and we've also got camellia flower here in diamantes, which was Coco Chanel's favourite flower. So this is very much an elevated classic flap. A really, really special piece to have in your collection. Um, it is a double, oh, it's a single flap. It's a single flap which means it's slightly lighter as well, slightly lighter carry. Interior lining. And the serial code on this is 19 series. 19 series with its card, box and dust bag. This is a full set Chanel bag with an amazing chain on this. Now, I can only imagine what this is going to look like when you put it on. When you have these kind of chain details on a bag and you wear it as a crossbody, they tend to sit, yeah, they tend to sit kind of almost like where your necklaces will sit. So you have this really beautiful additional kind of, it's like jewelry. This bag has like pieces of jewelry um, attached to it. It's absolutely stunning. Um, that sits kind of across the chest and it is a kind of a mid-length um, chain drop. I'd say it's probably an 18 or a 19 inch. This is a 10 inch classic, which is considered as the medium. Um, and another way you can also wear this, of course, is with its double chain. And again, with those charm details, once you put that over the arm, they just have placed them so perfectly that you can just see them right from the front. This is definitely like the focus point of this bag. Um, how beautiful is this? It's a beautiful color as well. Something that you can, you know, dress up and down. I would wear this, I don't really tend to wear pink, but I'd wear it with khaki green um, and darker tones to give it more of, you know, a trendy street style look, but you could pretty this up really nicely with creams and matching pinks and um, like yellows as well. So you could do so much with pink. It really is such a versatile color. This is in pristine condition. There's no corner wear. The leather is puffy and shiny. There's no um, discolorations to the back. It's an A1 condition piece. It's a full set, guys. And what a special Chanel bag. I'm so excited to see the price. We've got additional compartments and pockets inside so you can keep your things organized. And that classic turn knot closure at the front. Oh, I'm missing all the comments again, hang on. Have we got Sabrina in the house? No. Okay. Um, the skew on this one. Yeah, that's, that's the one, uh, Kristen. Maybe the images were mixed up on both of those bags. Um, but that's the skew, it ends in 019, yes, that's the one. I'm obsessed. I'm actually obsessed with this chain. It looks so, so beautiful. Sub, we don't have any Judith Lieber, although we very much have the same style if you love Ju Judith Lieber. I'm obsessed with Judith Lieber bags. I love the big dollar sign that they did and also the uh, McDonald's chip bag. I thought it was actually amazing. Um, Nils, so the chains, uh, they can't be removed. No, you would probably have to actually take them off with their links, but they're not removable. And they are both pearl finish. So you've got pearls to this one, and then you've got like diamantes onto the love hearts. So you've got kind of a combination of sparkle and pearls, very Chanel and very, very classic. Show you the back. Isn't she stunning? I'm obsessed. Imagine adding these to charm. Yeah, imagine adding the charms as a necklace. I mean, you could do. You'd have to probably take the bag apart or at least the chain, 
but you definitely could do. I just love the way that that sits. Honestly, I think this is so beautiful. This price is really, really good for a bag like this. Um, honestly, for, the, for those additional charms, for a full set, for pink, medium, like that price, guys, is really, really impressive. Um, it's uh, £6,995, which is um, 8130 US dollars. I'm really impressed with that. I thought it would be around the seven and a half mark. Um, take a look, guys. It, it, it is pinned. Um, I'll give you guys a close-up of the Diamantes, but no, there's nothing missing here. Let me show you charms. It's actually stunning. Hey, Isabel. The pictures are different. I think that's okay, Nadia. As long as the skew, ma uh, the skew matches up, the price will be what you see. And this one is the skew for that one. So if the, if the images might have accidentally been um, mixed up when these items were being uploaded. Um, but this is the correct bag at the correct price. So that is available. That also comes with its box and dust bag. Um, let's do, should we do a black classic? Let's do something black. It's so beautiful. It is like the Love Heart Suites. Yeah, that's so true. Um, the next one, Kristen, it ends in 1015. I'm moving on to a really special Chanel black lambskin shoulder bag. This has a really unique edge to it. Um, it has all of the classic elements, such as the matte lace quilted stitch, but you've actually got um, like almost like an elevated turn lock here. The, the hardware has like the crisscrosses, just the leather does, so I wanna show you a close up. This is 24 karat gold. You can see here that it, it has like the, um, like the quilted detail to the hardware. And another thing I really love with this bag is actually the quilted details to each side, which is like basically where the strap is attached on each side. Rounded flap, which kind of reminds me of like the Diana. So it has all of these really beautiful classic elements um, of a classic Chanel that we all want. Um, this is really, really beautiful. Definitely more of like a casual style bag as it does have a leather strap quilted strap which goes as a perfect cross wow this is special this is really really nice um sits uh around this is probably an 18 or a 19 inch drop um and guys this is vintage honestly look at the condition of this leather like considering guys this is vintage i'm really excited to know the year of this actually because the condition is actually fantastic um this is a wow this is a two series this is a 1991 um, yeah, if you guys could just, uh, read Kristen's, uh, comment there during a live, we're like, we have our hands tied. We really can't look into orders and all of the voucher stuff. So if you could please get in touch with Carla at luxurypromise.com, she's going to have a look at that. Um, it's super late where she is right now. She's in Dubai, but in the morning she'll get onto that. So just send over your inquiries to her. This is a two series with its card. It's in literally pristine condition. This looks fresh out of the store. Like, look at the puffy leather, the shine, nice spacious back pocket, great crossbody. Oh my gosh, it's so, so good. Again, Dana, if you could please email Carla, that would be great, thank you. Um, let's get this one up, she is pinned. The price is amazing. This is a two series with card. It has all of the classic elements that you want. It's, it's lambskin marine. Um, guys, this is £3,595, way, way, way under market price. That is a really great price. It's the same size as a medium classic flap. It has the same closure as the Diana. It has a beautiful crossbody strap, just like the, ca the camera bags do. This has all of the elements of a 90s Chanel that you want, and it's in excellent condition. In dollars, that's 4,180. It is pinned. I quickly added some images there, but guys, as I've mentioned, today's pieces are in pristine condition. You are gonna be so happy with absolutely perfect pieces. So 
this is a really really good one that has to has to go home with someone i love the hardware at the side i think that's so fabulous and it turns turns the strap like it's absolutely beautiful okay whilst we're on the topic of um, vintage lambskins and blacks let's do something slightly more unique again something with a fun twist um, the bag show in the live event does not match the photos on the website or Starbox. Um, which which bag are you looking at? We did have we did have this discussion slightly earlier. Um, some of the pictures might um, have I think been mixed up. Um, Valentine bag shows different charms than on the photo. Yes, if you want me to recap the Valentine's bag, I can. However, these pictures I think are incorrect. Um, so it is that bag. It's the same price. It's the, the same skew. You will receive the one that we have here. Um, and I can also uh, contact you after the live show with additional images if you wanted me to as well. Um, this is fun, I agree. This is a combination of chevron and the Mademoiselle vertical stitch. It's really, really beautiful. This has a structured finish. Um, it's lambskin and guys, look at that shine. Honestly, this is absolutely amazing. We have 24 karat gold hardware. This has a CC turn lock opening to the front and then an envelope closure, which is quite a unique opening actually. This is rare, Jazz, you know, you know. <laughs> Girl, you know, when we have a rare piece, this is definitely one of them. The inside is um, burgundy. It is a two series, again, 1990. However, serial code is perfectly intact. So you can see the serial code at the base. There's minimal signs of wear to this. This has more of like a box-like structure, which I really, really like. Um, and it does also have a double chain, so you can style it either over the shoulder. Wow, this is special. This is really, really nice. The way that that sits on the shoulder. Oh, this is so good. Me and Chris are like, wow. <laughs> Um, this will go as a high cross as well. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. The wet, as soon as I put this on, I was like, wow, this is amazing. This is really, really special. I love the box-like finish to this. And the combination of the chevron and the vertical stitch is, is absolutely something. On the back as well, it has the chevron. And what you'll see here is just some slight press marks, but just like skin guys, sometimes we need a massage and leather actually works the same. Um, especially with slight press marks from a chain, you can actually just massage it out and they will come out perfectly. It's black sandy and Melissa, how special is this? It's black lambskin. Nice spacious back pocket here, perfect for a phone a wallet, all of your small essentials that you need to access very quickly. And then that double chain allows you to um, style this up in different ways. It's so beautiful. Have to put it on again. <gasps> Look at the shine. Oh my gosh, I'm actually obsessed. I don't think I've ever seen this before. Also over the arm like this as well, just handheld is beautiful. I'm obsessed guys, absolutely obsessed. So what we'll do, is we will get this pinned and then I can recap the uh, Valentine's bag. That price, oh my gosh, guys, this is £4,950. Supermodel vibe, yeah, it is. £4,950, which is 5755 US dollars. Under £5,000 for, honestly, a totally rare and unique Chanel piece from 1991. You guys, these are the right images I can see. It's pinned. Take a look there. Um, let me know, guys, if you've got questions about that. We're covering your customs and duties only for the next 45 minutes on these items. I'm totally obsessed with that one. That's such a special one. Um, I'll quickly recap the Valentine's bag um, and I'll give you guys the skew. Um, Sandy, if you refresh, it will refresh. Clearly, Kristen's price slashing behind. So just refresh it and it will it will adjust. Um, the skew, just to confirm guys, for the Valentine's ends in P0019. P0019, it is the right skew. I just believe the, the images are um, wrong. This is the Valentine's medium classic flap. 
It's got that beautiful charm detail on the chain here. We've got pearls and diamantes, love hearts, camellia flowers, logos, absolutely everything. This comes as a full set, box, dust bag, and card, and it's in pristine condition. This was an insane price, especially for like this pink and this kind of limited edition collection here. I think it was just under 7,000, and it's a full set. It's absolutely beautiful. Okay, guys, I want you guys to tell me what you want today. Um, is anybody in the market for the turquoise one? Because the price was amazing. It was $3,850. Um, I've been selling these a thousand pound more. We did an auction at the start of the show and, and um, the winning bid was three eight fifty, and she hasn't paid. So if you guys want the deal of the day, this is the deal of the day. Chrissy, this one, this, was, this went in an auction at the start and the lady couldn't check out, unfortunately. And it, the winning bid was 3850 on that one and it's actually insane. Um, Sandy, the vertical comes with, let's have a look. The vertical comes with, I think it just comes with its um, serial code. Yeah, it's just serial sticker only on that one. Uh, we've also shown the medium classic flat. We've shown the jumbo. Hey, Kristen. The Kelly we have shown, but I will recap this for you now. Um, May I please see the Chanel Extra Mini? Yeah, of course, Joy. Um, Kristen, if you're in the market for a Kelly today, we have this one, um, which is under 20,000. This is um, 19,995 pounds. Um, this is a swift leather in black noir with um, yellow gold hardware. This is pristine condition. It was a tea stamp, which is 2015, and it comes with its key clochette, padlock, and also its strap as well as its dust bag as well. She's in pristine condition. The inside is immaculate. There's no corner wear. And there's also no wear to the back as well. So this one has been pinned. Um, you guys can find that here, 19995 for this. Um, it is um, up on split it as well. You guys can use split it with this and you would be splitting that total value over 12 months. So it's a really great one. Anything black in a 25 um, or smaller in Hermes for under 20,000 really is hard to find. So this is a really great one today. I'll move on to that one next for you, Julia, of course. Um, the Neverfall that we have here, Isabel, I don't know if you're still here or you're driving. Hey, Sabrina. How amazing is that, Kelly? Insane. And under 20,000? Like, insane, insane. Okay, I'm moving on to the Louis Vuitton Neverfull bag. This is in the, I think this is the GM. Maybe it's the MM. Let me double check the label. Um, MM, okay guys. We're moving on to a medium Louis Vuitton Neverfull bag with a really fun twist. This is a limited edition collection. I think it's from the Voyage collection. And this has the classic Louis Vuitton monogram logo. And then what you'll see in the middle here is this really fun blue monogram, which is so, so stunning. I love this pop of color. I love the fact that you have the V on the front with the blue, but then towards the back, it's just plain classic. So you kind of have a two in one here. That turquoise blue against the brown, I don't know what it does to me, but it's actually really, really amazing. They should do more of this. They should do more bags in this monogram. It's insane. Hey, Isabel. <laughs> she's here. She's wrapping orders, guys. She's listening to me and wrapping orders. And then, I mean, the inside just gets better. We've got this blue teal lining in canvas pinstripe, an additional pocket, minimal wear to this. There's barely any signs of use. You do have that clip at the top. And the Neverfull bag is super lightweight as it's, um, as it's canvas, but it's designed to carry loads with you, honestly. It carries absolutely anything you need, a laptop. It's gonna be a great kind of travel bag, work bag. It's just one of those bags that I feel like everybody should have a Neverfull in their life. Um, this is in pristine condition. I know we've got everyone here. Um, Chris, I'm gonna move on to that one next. Best Neverfull you've seen, Kelly. Oh, good, I'm glad. 
Um, pristine condition, guys, nothing to point out on the wear. This is still under retail, it's £2,295, which is 2668 US dollars. Um, yeah, customs and duties are covered, guys. You can find this pinned, the images are there, and obviously I'm here to answer any of your questions. Hey, Daniela. Hey, Nikki. Um, isn't she gorgeous? Honestly, you've got fun classic with color, and then you've got that nice classic back as well. And um, it's the inside for me. It's it's the little things that matter, right? It's the inside lining for me that is like a deal breaker. I absolutely love it. Um, lots of you have asked to see the black classic Chanel, which is behind me, so let's do that now. I believe this is known as the ultra mini classic flap. And the one that we have here, oh, this is good actually. Let me pull the chain out. The one that we have here is in black satin. So it's a very luxurious, um, kind of an elegant feel to a mini, ultra mini classic. It also has the um, chocolate bar stitch in gold. So this is a really beautiful black and gold combination. You'll see around the edges here, it has a gold stitching, almost like a small wild stitch, but it's subtle, but it's there. In the light, it kind of catches that gold tone and you'll also see that around the back as well. It even comes with a leather camellia flower in black lambskin. Oh my gosh, it's so, it's so soft. <laughs> Little uh, camellia flower at the top here. This is so beautiful. This is a really elegant bag. Um, and I love the dainty chain on this. You've got very small, um, detailed leather and twine chain. Again, gold hardware. And this actually opens up with a magnetic pop lock here, which you'll see a nice CC logo on the front as well. I can show you the classic flap, um, um, Nika, yeah. It is a small, you're right, it's a small. So when we move to the inside of the bag, you'll see that it comes with its uh, original card. It comes with its dust bag. This is an eight series. So this is a um, early 2000s piece and it kind of gives that vibe with the flower and the, you know, the mini style. The inside is actually lined with um, nylon. Nylon lining. Chanel logo all the way through the base. And even in the satin, it almost has like a glittery look, slightly glittery. Wow, this is really, really special. Um, minimal signs of wear, again, A1 condition. It's got this beautiful um, small mini chain that goes as a nice length um, crossbody. Um, it's a more of a relaxed cross. It sits slightly lower. Um, price is amazing. This is £3,419 which is 3,967 US dollars for an excellent condition, early 2000s chocolate bar ultra mini with a black lambskin camellia. What a special bag and what a unique bag to have as well. Um, you could definitely play around with the chain on this and potentially create that double drop. Yeah, you can. The flower is so cute. Again, it's these little things. Look how nice that looks. That's like a mini over the shoulder. I love it. I think it's so adorable. Absolutely love that, guys. It's up and pinned. Take a look and let me know. Audrey Hepburn would wear this. You're so right. She would. I would as well. <laughs> I love her. She's gorgeous. Okay, some requests for the classic flaps. We'll move on to that one next. Just get this baby locked up. Okay. And then we can move on to the small classic flap. Um, hey Lex, no worries. Can you recap the year of the Chevron flap and is it accompanied with anything? Well, first of all, you have great taste. Um, <laughs> the Chevron flap is like a box-like structure. Um, 24 karat gold. This is 1991 in pristine condition. Um, it does not come with anything. It doesn't have anything, but you will receive a luxury promise dust bag and also a luxury promise box. It's a two series 1991 in pristine condition. There's minimal signs of wear in any of the places on the bag. You've got an adjustable double chain, which allows you to style either over the shoulder or you can also style this as a cross as well. 
a really unique collectible early 90s Chanel. Lex, let me know if there's anything else I can help you with that on that one. Um, it's a great one, trust me. We very rarely get these, especially in this condition. Like, it's stunning. Um, Ashley, that one's coming up very shortly, I promise. I'm going to do the small classic flap as we've had a few requests for this. Um, hey, Elle. Yeah, the, the Kelly is amazing. Um, the Kelly is in swift leather. And it's a Kelly 25. It's in black, of course. It's in classic black noir. And it's paired with yellow gold hardware. It's a tea stamp. So it's a 2015. And it comes with its dust bag, its padlock, its key clochette, its felt, and its rain cover. So it comes with everything apart from its box. Um, the strap length makes it a perfect crossbody. It sits kind of mid waist length. Um, I will show that one, Daniela. Yeah, that's also coming up shortly. And this is in pristine condition. No signs of wear. The seals are not on the hardware, but there's literally no signs of even hairline scratches. It's a pristine condition bag. Um, this is up for £19,995. Um, and you guys can also use Splitter on this as it's under 20000 You just need a credit card with the total value of the order on the card. Um, if you'd like to check out on that, guys, you can find this through the handbag icon, which is at the bottom part of your screen. Okay, the small classic flap. Let's take a look. No worries. So this is the small classic flap. The classic flap in the small size measures nine inches across. This is lambskin. It's black lambskin. And the shine on this is like no other honestly it's so shiny and special it feels like butter it has that beautiful quality look um and there's minimal signs of wear on this it's literally a, a pristine condition there's no corner wear there's no tarnish to the gold um and this is a double flap so we'll open this up so you guys can see you'll start to see like with vintage classic flaps um underneath the first flap you'll see potentially some press marks um, and you know, that is actually just from the chain. It's just the way that the bag is made. So we wouldn't class that as wear. That kind of just happens over time. Even if you buy them from the store now, the chain just presses into the inside of the bag. It just happens. Um, but this one does come with a card. This is a one series. So this is a 1989 classic with red burgundy lining interior, pristine condition inside. I'm going to put the card safely in its pocket here, but it is a one series uh, 1989. Um, and I, I would give this like a nine out of 10 considering this is, you know, 80s. It's absolutely beautiful condition. Um, you really, really cannot get much better than this one. They are high crosses. So they're around a 17 inch drop, which works. It's comfortable. Um, it sits kind of snug into the waist. Remember, I'm 5 foot 11. I'm on the taller side. So if you are slightly shorter than me, it would probably sit slightly lower. But it does sit really nicely into the waist. Wow, she's beautiful. Um, comes with card as well, guys, for a one series. That can be quite a hard thing to find. Um, beautiful, small classic, black lamb skin. Um, she's great. Isn't she? I love her. Gorgeous, shiny leather. Show you again a close up. Okay, now this one, this is up for 5,300 pounds, which is 6,160 US dollars. And we do cover your customs, guys, just for the duration of the show. Thank you, I'm so glad you're enjoying the show. I know I picked some, um, Different pieces today, I wanted to give you guys some new and old, but really good condition ones. Um, this is available now, guys. It is pinned. You can find her there with more images. And obviously, you can ask me any questions at any point. Let's do the graffiti bag as well, because somebody had asked for that one. Wow, this is fun. This is really, really fun. Um, so we now have a, this is known as like the rectangle flap, um, and this is, this is amazing. The colours inside, okay, let me talk you guys through this bag. So this is known as the rectangle, rectangle classic flap. Um, it is slightly thinner than the usual classic, but look at this design. This is like a graffiti, almost like a tie-dye, um, multicoloured, look at the back, it goes into the, oh, 
Look at the back of this. Look at the purples. This is insane. So what you'll see here is you'll see a big CC logo into the leather. This is classic quilting with that kind of tie dye graffiti look. And then to the back of the bag, you'll see these purples and these beautiful oranges and red tones. Um, my favorite hardware currently is actually ruthenium. And ruthenium hardware is a dark gunmetal gray. And uh, isn't it, Kristen, this bag, you, again, you know. We know, like, this is rare, this has not come up. Um, ruthenium hardware gives it a really kind of um, edgy, trendy look, and it all, it's slightly muted as well. I think if this had gold hardware, it would just be too much, whereas the dark gray kind of gives it a slightly muted look. So it's all about the color of the leather here. Um, the chain is multicolored as well. So we've got different tones, colors, and, and um, tones and colors through the chain. Um, and it's a slightly thinner chain as well. Um, smaller details on this are, are beautiful. You'll see around the edging where the chain is into the bag, it says Chanel. And you see that on all four um, loops. I'll show you what it looks like on. This is so good. Nice, comfortable over the shoulder. This will go nicely as a cross as well. Slightly longer drop actually on this, which is really nice. And then inside the bag is just as beautiful. You'll see more of the kind of tie dye effect here. Those darker tones really coming through. This comes with its dust bag. The inside is black canvas. And this comes with a card. This is a 21 series in pristine condition. I wanna give you guys a pan of the bag. So this is the inside. And then around the back, you get that, oh my goodness, this is actually insane. You get that really amazing kind of rainbow multicolored look here. Again, this is a bag that will go with everything because it has so many different colors and tones in. Um, you could wear this with everything. This is definitely the statement of your look. So you can keep it really casual and simple and put this on for a really, really amazing look. So card and dust bag included excellent condition it's a 21 series this one is 6150 pounds which is 7150 us dollars it's a 21 series which i think is a uh aab no she knows 2015 to 16 so it's not too old it's around you know six or seven uh yeah six or seven years old This is, this is special. I don't know when we'll get this in again. And these items are only available for the live guys. I don't have access to these once I leave. So if you do see something you love, grab it whilst you can and avoid those customs fees as well. It's so good. Okay, let's do the boy bag. Somebody was asking for the boy bag. This is, um, for me, one of my favorite Chanel uh, bags, the boy. I love the slightly chunkier hardware. I love the, um, the hardware to the front. I just love the vibe of the boy bag. It's a really fun and trendy piece. Slightly more um, like out there than the classic flap. So I think definitely more my style. Now this one is beautiful. This is the small size, um, but this is in velvet and it is in the most incredible cherry red color. Velvet for me is just beautiful in a bag. It gives depth, it has this beautiful, luxurious look. Um, and especially on camera, you can really see the quality of this. It's a cherry red velvet paired with brushed yellow gold hardware. The boy bag has a pencil lock opening, which opens up into one main compartment. Um, but this does also have like a double chain as well. Rich, that's the only word for this, it's just rich. Um, it has a nice comfort strap actually in leather, which you can adjust to different lengths. It goes as a cross. Yeah, we've got some different pieces today for sure. Um, goes as a nice comfortable cross. And then with a double chain, you can also you know, wear this just over the shoulder as well. Oh my goodness, this is wow. This is a wow bag. Um, let's see the condition. Condition is b beautiful, honestly. No corner wear, there's d no dullness to the velvet, there's no color transfer, discoloration. 
Like, this is stunning. Chrissy, you cannot go wrong with a black boy bag. It's one of my all-time favorite classics. I would get a black boy bag over a classic flap. I just love the boy bag. I think it's insane. Um, this also comes with its card, actually, which is great. This is a 29 series, so relatively new, actually. Inside is canvas and lambskin. Again, minimal wear on this. A1 condition absolutely insane something you will not find very easily at all perfect for the holidays jazz but i find red is just one of those colors that is great for summer it's great for winter it's great for all occasions and it goes with everything as well so this is a really really special one guys on instagram look at this bag insane and the small bag the small boy bag it fits a phone in if it's a card holder it's a great bag for like your small essentials i'm obsessed when it hits the light, absolutely insane. And I love velvet as well, the way that like, the way that you kind of push it, it gives different looks, it's just beautiful. Show you a close up. Wow, it's stunning. I love it. So we're gonna get the price up. This is 4,750 pounds, which is 5,522 US dollars. Um, we cover your customs, we cover your duties, and we ship worldwide for this very special small boy bag, guys, only available for today. Um, have a click on that icon and it's going to show you some more images and obviously guys I'm here to answer any of your questions. I've got some earrings now that I want to move on to. Um, we still have both brooches available, especially this one. I'm really surprised this one hasn't gone. This is 1995 um, Chanel. It's in the clover shape and it's slightly bigger than the regular size um, brooch, which means you can style it in loads of ways. I always gravitate towards putting it in my hair because I just love the way that the gold looks against like darker hair but you can wear this on a hat in a scarf you can wear it kind of as a necklace on just add it onto a chain and wear it as a choker also if you're wearing a shirt around the neck um, in between the collar it looks great um, even just in the center of any top like it just completely transforms it um, also around the waist on um, trousers jeans skirts you name it guys this was 1150 pounds 1995, very collectible, 24 karat gold. Um, you guys can find that through the handbag icon at the bottom part of your screen. This is a really, really great piece. It's also from 1995, making it super collectible. That's a very iconic year. It has been pinned also, you can find it there, but this is a great one, guys. Um, the earrings that I have today are classic quilting um, clip-ons. These are from 1996. And they are a button style um, CC um, Chanel clip on earring. They are 24 karat gold. Please excuse my nails. They are majorly grown out. <laughs> um, this is 24 karat gold classic quilting with that CC logo. Um, these are great condition, minimal tarnish. And this is a great everyday size, I would say. Um, a nice a nice uh, like daily piece of gold jewelry to wear. They're not too big. You know, they're not too out there. You can definitely wear these in the day, but also these will transition nicely into the evening as well. The way that you can make your Chanel jewelry pop really is simply by just putting your hair up or wearing, you know, your hair slightly up and then having the jewelry as the focus. Um, this is what they look like on. <laughs> this is what they look like on. No tarnish, 1996 guys. Um, and really, really beautiful and classic. I just love these, honestly. Clip-ons, if you guys haven't tried clip-ons, um, we always get the same questions. Are they comfortable? Do they hurt? And I always thought the same until I tried them. Now I try them on all day, every day, but um, Kristen wears them all day and she literally lives in them and she loves them and they are so, so comfortable. Um, and I just, I love the feel of them. I love the vintage, you know, they feel like vintage, they look vintage and the quality is just incredible as well. You cannot find stud earrings that look like clip-on earrings. You just can't. Um, I don't know why, they just are not the same anymore. 
you can get that, you've slashed these. Oh, we're doing a good price on these guys. Let me show you a close up again. Um, Alex, my necklace is, do you mean the chain or the pendant? My chain, I think they're just the classic 15 or 16 inch. Um, my, I wear mine 15. I like it when it sits like in between the collarbone here. So I wear it on its shortest setting. And um, it is just, this is, a, uh, this is a vintage. I got this quite recently. It's just the classic Alhambra style. Uh, they are much quicker to put on, yeah. Um, these are 800, 807, oh, they've been slashed. They were 879. These are now uh, 790 pounds, which is 920 US dollars. Excellent condition, 1996. And they are pinned. You guys can find them in that top left-hand corner. They're so gorgeous. Okay, guys, I wanna ask you if there's anything that you want to see today. Um, I have obviously the brooch is still available. We've gone through some classics. I have maybe like one or two bags to go. Um, but is there anything you want me to quickly recap? Um, I don't have many more new pieces to show that I can pull in. Um, can you see the Chanel logo from a distance? Tina, yeah, you can. Let me turn the brightness slightly down for you on the lights. I think I can turn it down. Oh, I can't turn it down, but yeah, you can see you can see it, Tina. I'll just stay here for a second. Can you see? You can just see it there. We have the wallet on chain as well, Chrissy. Yeah, I'm going to move on to that one now. That's all of the jewellery today, Ali, um, but I will have lots more on my show tomorrow morning. Um, it will be at, I believe, 10 a.m. EST, which is 3 p.m. BST on Instagram. I'll, I'll have lots of jewellery tomorrow, guys, I promise. This is beautiful, and I've actually just realised it also has these additional chains on the... Um, uh, charms on the chain it's really nice so this is like a i would say like a raspberry red it has slightly pinky undertones it's caviar leather with this chevron details here and here um this has got brushed gold champagne hardware um and then a red leather entwined chain this color pops like this is an insane insane color um this has a back pocket um, and I would use this for credit cards or business cards. Very unique today. Yeah, I wanted to pick different things today, guys. Um, and then just like the other uh, wallet on chain, this opens up into lots of room for cards, coins, cash, keys, and a phone. You can see that one, yeah. This comes with this card. It's a 25 series. Um, I would go as far as saying this probably hasn't been used because it's got all of its original card slots inside. So a pristine condition wallet on chain. The charms on this are beautiful. It, Nikki, it's kind of like a red pink. Um, it's like a red pink. It has very, very like pinky orangey undertones. Um, let me compare it to the other one just so you can see. Yeah, slightly more of a like a vibrant raspberry red kind of tone. Hey Mike, um, let me show you as a cross again with that with those charms on the front. That will really um, look nice, kind of at the front. The charms are oh, they're really nice. You've got an owl, like an owl with CC eyes, and then we've got this kind of like CC logo here, and that's a Chanel at the base. It's beautiful. Excellent condition, comes with cards. I would definitely double the chain up on this. Let's try it. Yeah, I would wear it like this. Charms at the front, double chain over the shoulder, chevron details. 
it's so cute i love it it's so good let me flip the camera as well in like a less harsh light you guys get a look at the color and then we'll get the price up beautiful really really beautiful it would polly um it would i keep missing your prices Kristen. um okay this is 3,400 pounds, which is 3,950 US dollars. Um, it is pinned now, guys. You can find it there. Polly, it would fit a, a large phone in, yes. I think it measures around eight, eight or seven and a half inches across. Um, so yeah, it's definitely suitable for a large phone, plus a set of keys, and you can actually even fit a lipstick in as well. So it's a, a really, really great piece. The price is up, and we're covering your customs, guys, just for the show. Um, next up, we'll do the beige jumbo. Um, who was the lovely lady asking for this one? Okay, uh, Gray, this is for you. So this is the jumbo. Um, it's in um, caviar leather, and it's in like a really, really milky beige. Um, it's like an almost like an off-white, like a cream beige. It's beautiful. This is with silver hardware, like a silver mirrored hardware finish. And this is in excellent, excellent condition. It's got that nice spacious back pocket. No corner wear, no signs of wear at all, actually. Um, and it's a double flap. So you've got that nice creamy um, inside. The inside is lambskin. You've got that Stitch CC logo. Um, this comes with its uh, felt. It also comes with its care booklet. And this was a 15 series in pristine condition. The price was way under retail. It's a perfect over the shoulder such a good color um, this is great for winter this is a great way to lighten up your looks with the caviar it's nice and durable so you don't have to worry too much about you know uh, damaging it even if it's a lighter tone because the caviar withstands that really quite well um, it's a really really fun bag a great color and a really timeless combination as well so this is up let me know if you have any questions about that she is pinned there we go Hey guys, if I could just ask if you have got any of the pieces behind me, if you want me to recap. Um, Mike, is there a particular Chanel bag that you were looking at behind me? Um, obviously, we've got the, we've got the uh, black one here, which is quilted. We've got the black Kelly. We've also got the chevron here, which is like a square. And then we've got the um, early 2000s chocolate bar ultra mini, which is beautiful as well. Um, now would be the time, guys, to let me know if you want me to recap anything. Jazz, the, uh, which one? The, the beige? Which one, Jazz? You mean the beige jumbo? It just comes with its, um, I think it was just felt on its hair booklet. Yeah, it comes with its felt and its care booklet. And then you'll receive a luxury promise dust bag um, and authenticity card as well with that one. The black quilted. Okay, let's do that one. This is stunning, Mike. Honestly, a really... Oh, the orange box, I will show you. Um, this is a really beautiful classic piece. It's lambskin leather, 24 karat gold. This was 1991 two series. It has more of a casual style crossbody. It is a leather strap with these really amazing hardware details to each side. Um, this opens up into a nice spacious single compartment, black lined interior with its card. Excellent, excellent condition. I mean, you can see by the leather how puffy and amazing it is. And then as a crossbody, it sits really nicely with that leather strap sits just above the hip this is like buying like a new chanel bag or like traveling back to 1991 and buying a bag like it literally is such amazing condition so that is up you can find that there mike let me know if you've got more questions 
The um, the bag which was who the boy bag. Um, the boy bag tears. This one's for you. This was the um, red velvet small boy bag. Um, it's brushed yellow gold hardware, pristine condition. Um, this is rich. This is like rich, elegant, absolutely gorgeous. It has pincer lock opening into one main compartment. Um, this comes with its original card and it's a 29 series, so relatively current season actually. Um, it goes as a perfect cross. It's so good. Honestly, this is a great one. So that one is also available. And then the last bag that I have to show is, I know Sabrina, how amazing is that red? You can do split it, Jazz, exactly. The last bag that I have to show is quite special, something that I've not seen before. Um, this is actually a Hermes Constance. It's an 18. The Beige Abbey, um, I will quickly recap that. If you click on the icon here, you'll be able to see the price of that. And then if you need it in any other conversions, just let us know. Um, this, guys, is a bag I've not seen before. <laughs> this is an Hermes Constance 18 with its box, with its dust bag, in blue box leather. Like, honestly, I've never ever seen this color box leather in my life. There are still seals on the hardware on this. You've still got seals on the hardware. It is a um, it is a yellow gold hardware finish. No, Hannah, you've been on lots of my shows recently. Welcome. Are you new to us? I've only recently noticed, like Hannah K in the comments. Blue electric, exactly, guys. Look, <gasps> this is like a gasping moment. Oh my goodness. This is absolutely insane. Seals on the hardware. Um, wow. I am blown away by this. This is amazing. Oh my goodness. This color is insane. Welcome, Hannah. I hope you're enjoying the shows. Um, so this opens up into two compartments. This is a, let me see the stamp. A Y stamp, I think that's 2020. Yeah, I think this is like 2020. This comes as a full set. This also goes as a crossbody as well. Oh my goodness, I'm actually totally obsessed with this. This is stunning, honestly. Look at that color, guys. It looks like blue electric in like a box. It's, I'm sure it's box. Um, I saw somebody comment, maybe it's Tadillac, but I'm pretty sure this is box leather. I'm <laughs> spending too much money. <laughs> I know, it's an addiction. Alison, how amazing is this? Um, condition on this is really good. I would say at the most, we have maybe one scratch just there. It's, that's me being like really, really fussy. Um, I'd say maybe one scratch, seals on the hardware, nowhere to the back and nowhere to the corners. <laughs> what did I miss? <laughs> How stunning is this, guys? Um, comes with box and dust bag. Bright blue in box leather with gold hardware. It's a Constance 18. This is not something that comes up very often. I think this is the nicest Constance I think I've ever seen, actually. That is a statement, honestly. Just my card called for fraud alert. Okay. Let's get this up. Kristen, are you ready? Let's get the price up of this. This is 16900 and 50 pounds, which is 19,693 US dollars. Blue electric box, guys, full set, absolutely stunning. Y stamp, excellent condition with one teeny tiny scratch, 
Remember, I'm standing in this really, really bright light as well. You wouldn't be able to see it in, like, in the natural light. She's up, she's available. Have a look, let me know, guys. Amazing piece. Something that we do not get in often at all. She's a real special one. And then somebody wanted me to recap. Let's see. Somebody wanted me to recap. Hey, Sandra, I'm with you now. Um, the Kanban uh, Kanban wallet and the chocolate bar. Sure, let's do that now. So. Let's do the Kanban wallet. So this was the Kanban wallet, which is quilted lambskin with a patent leather combination. Um, bright pink interior with its card. You've got several card holders. You've got a coin purse. You can fit your passport in here. You can fit your wallet in here. Um, it's literally an excellent condition piece. Opens up almost like an organizer. You can fit, you know, your travel documents, your passport. You can do so much with this. Um, luxury addiction is real. It really is real, trust me. Um, minimal signs of wear. This is excellent condition. I'd say if I'm being really, really particular here, there's one small mark just to the inside, just there. Um, but excellent condition. And that was $7.95, a great price. And then the chocolate bar was from the early 2000s. This is uh, crafted from a black satin with like a gold shimmery finish. And then you've got gold stitching as well. Beautiful, very, very delicate leather and twine chain. And then you've got a lambskin rose, um, lambskin uh, camellia flower just at the top here. Yeah, Mike, you can find all of the bags behind me under the handbag icon around here on your screen. Looks like a small um, handbag. Click on it and it will show you everything I've been through today. Um, I'm logging off guys after this one. So let me know if there's anything else you want me to recap. This is in excellent condition. I love the shine to this. It has that beautiful sheen. This comes with its care booklet, it comes with its card, and it comes with its dust bag as well. The inside is lined with nylon. She's a beauty, honestly. This is a really, really special one. Um, so she's also available. So guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna log off now because I have to leave this office in like literally 10 minutes ago, um, but I'm gonna leave the collection live for one hour only, and if anyone places any orders, I will honor the customs and duties being covered. So just bear that in mind. If you guys have any questions, you can reach out to me. Um, I would say DMing me is the best way to reach to me. Sometimes I've noticed a couple of DMs have been going into my junk, into my spam, um, so if that happens, just maybe send me another DM and I'll like look through both this evening. But if you guys have any questions about these products, let me know. I'll leave them live on the website. Um, thank you, Kristen, for moderating. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the selection today. I wanted to do something a little bit different, bring you guys some newer season pieces and some interesting colors and designs as well. Um, I'm going to be back tomorrow morning early at 10 a.m. Um, 10 a.m. EST, which is 3 p.m. BST with Colleen on Instagram. I think I'll be live for an hour or so. It won't be a very long one. And then that is it for my New York shows. So yeah, that's it. I'm going to be back in London next week. Um, thank you so much guys for all of your continued support. You make this so much fun for me. Um, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Have a lovely evening.